you're all together again. You were just together at the premiere in London, yeah. and it's exciting that you're here in New York. Well, it's so exciting. I mean, I have to say, it's always brilliant to bring a premiere to, of this show to, to America. I mean, the fans are so enthusiastic, and it, is, it really, I think, resonates with the American audience, so yeah. Yeah, it's great. But why do you think the fans are so uh, in love with Downton Abbey for so many years? I think it's Julian's ability to give you 22 characters that you love and care about or you hate and loathe. But ultimately, it's the fact that he keeps those stories intertwined and constantly moving. And I don't know how he does it, because in two hours, you get to see all your favorite characters again in these crazy new situations. And you never feel like you're missing out on anyone. Great. Uh, what do you love about your character? Because he's gone through a lot of change from the series to the two different films. Yeah, I think my favorite thing about him actually is his, I guess, his uh, his his strength in himself as a, as a person, because he's obviously Hi. circumstances. Lady Eden. Hi, how you Hi. doing? Um, sneaking in. Yeah, sneaking in. Alan was just telling me about his character and what he loves about him. Yeah. I'm so sorry. No, what? no, no. What do you love about my character? I love everything about Tom Branson. We were saying earlier today that they're both very progressive, these two characters. Yeah, they come a long way. So they're, um, I think their determination mm -hmm. in the face of tragedy and, and, and loss yes. uh, as makes them the best characters in the show, I'm only joking. Absolutely. Yeah. Does it ever get old for you? Because when I hear that music, I get so excited to watch Downton. Yeah. No, I mean, I, I, it really moves me when I hear the, the theme tune as well. And yeah, see the house. It's always a great moment. It never gets old because these guys are my second family, you know, and know. anytime we get a chance to come back together, it's, it's kind of a pinch yourself moment. I can't believe that we still get to do this. Yeah. Yeah. And you're all, not all, but there's a lot of interconnectedness in, within the characters and the actors. Like, where is your other half this evening? Oh, he's in London. I'm sad he can't make it, but we miss him. We miss him a great deal. Yeah. But then he's also starting a group with Michelle. That's right. Yeah, yeah they're singing together. They've got an EP out together under Michael and Michelle. Yeah, Mikey and Michelle. Yeah. Listen to it. It's really beautiful music. Yeah, download it. Um, yeah, it's amazing. They're, their voices sound so beautiful together, and it's just something that happened organically between them. And I'm so pleased that people are going to get to hear it. It's really special. It's always scary when people are a quadruple threat, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. for sure. Yeah. You look beautiful. Tell me who you're wearing this evening. I'm wearing Oscar de la Renta. Oh, yeah. Fancy. <laughs> yeah. Fancy. In New York. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.